So it's doing a good job. Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm gonna to do a comparison between these two Shark cordless clean and empty vacuum cleaners. So this one here, this is like a dark blue. On your left, this is model number BU3523. Over here on your right, this is model number BU3521. What's the difference? Okay, this one here, the BU3523 comes with a motorized pet tool. So it's gonna get electricity from the uh, up here at the power head from the battery and it's got a motorized. Over here, this one is just like a brush. It's just a vacuum only. They both come with a crevice tool that is stowed back here. They are identical other than this motorized brush head. You're gonna be able to vacuum up. They have what's called auto sense. So when you've got three modes of operation, you got eco, auto, and then max or boost, which is it's gonna use a lot of battery, but it has maximum suction. In auto mode or auto sense, it's gonna sense the carpet. If you have carpet, that light will turn magenta and it speeds up the brush roller. If you have hardwood floors, it turns the brush roller a little bit slower. So auto sensing for the floor material. It doesn't auto sense for the, if there's dirt and debris coming up here. But these are really nice vacuums in the sense that you can vacuum up, you can't vacuum up your entire house, but a nice mess. Get it all vacuumed up. When you come back to the docking station, when you dock it, it's gonna empty everything out of here and it's also gonna charge it at the same time. So let's pretend this one's full. When I dock it, auto empty. Everything goes, they have the exact same dust bin back here. So. After about a month, you will have to clean this out. You have a window on the side here. Take this over the trash can, press the button. Everything's gonna come out. This is bagless. That's a nice feature. You do have some filters back here. These are reusable, but you are going to have to clean them. You're gonna have to rinse them out, let them dry outside. I do have a do not disturb button on both of them. If I press this little moon, now when I dock it, it's gonna charge it, but it doesn't auto empty it. So again, they're very simple to operate. You've got a display that shows you the battery and what mode you're in. Now I can put the motorized pet tool on and I picked up some hair off of a, of a chair. It's, it actually spins really, really fast and none of the hairs got stuck around it. So that is a pretty nice extra tool that it comes with. Now, once in a while you are going to have to um, clean these filters, pop this open. There is a HEPA filter in here, right here, that once in a while, it does get pretty dirty that you are going to have to clean it out. Take it out, but it's easy to come apart, put it back together. That's what that little hook right here is for. If you need to stow it without it on a dock station, you stow it like that. Otherwise you put it together and put it like that. So these are lightweight, very versatile, I like that they're bagless, but they are exactly the same. This one's kind of a light. This is a silver handle with kind of a light teal color up here. And this one here is like a dark blue. Let's take the battery off. One thing I did not check was the battery. Okay. These have the exact same battery. Yes. So you don't get more battery with one as opposed to the other, exact same battery. So there you have it. You do get this extra tool with this one. Let's connect, this is the pet tool that it has an electric motor in there that's gonna get power from the battery. Turn it on. Okay, that thing is spinning really fast, so be careful. And I can put that crevice tool on the end of this, or the I can even put, if I want to stand up and clean the pet beds, I can put it on the end of the wand also. Okay, we're gonna try the auto sense on carpet and hardwood floors. I'm gonna turn it on. Okay, it's magenta because it's on carpet. And now it switches to hardwood floor. I have the same suction power, it just slows down the roller.
So it's doing a good job. It is very lightweight to use. All right. And again, here's the best part. Put it on, charging it, and auto, auto empty and everything. Down into here. And now it's cleaned out up there, charged and ready to go. Okay, right now this one uh, with the extra tool, four hundred dollars. This one is on sale for two ninety one. So is this tool worth a hundred and ten dollars? I don't know. I've never seen this tool before. I've only seen it in this kit. Hopefully this will become available on Shark Ninja website. It's model number IW1000JMHT. So I have a detailed review on this one where I show you this tool, how it works. But yeah, I don't like when they do this identical stuff, different colors. It makes you think that there's something different about, there's absolutely nothing different between any of this. I can't see anything other than this tool that it comes with in a different color. Both of them are for sale on Amazon. I had to buy both of them with my own money because I just wanted to make sure, I wanted to help you as the consumer make the right choice. You know, if the one with the motorized pet tool is on sale, you're definitely gonna wanna get it because it does come with a really nice tool, but I wouldn't pay $110 more for that tool. Uh, and actually, they have two other ones. They have an older wand vac that auto empties, which I'm gonna compare these two, and they have a um, auto detect, which was last year's model. So that was 2023. These are 2024 models. They just kind of snuck up. I just happened to see them on Amazon. I forget which one's on the Shark Ninja website. Typically, I'm not sure if one or both of them. And you know what? They might even sell a different one at Walmart that's probably a red color or something. So, And they take out the LED lights. So they make very minor changes. But the one they sell at Walmart does have a different brush roller for the auto detect one. And it's smaller battery, so don't get the one at Walmart. They did some um, changes that I didn't like. So again, that's why I do my reviews. I want to buy these products with my own money. I'm not held by anybody. You know, Shark may not like that I do this, but I want to help you as the consumer. That's the whole purpose behind my videos is these are identical. I mean, everything's identical other than a tool attachment. So I don't like when they do that, but that way I can help you as the consumer get whichever one's cheaper. Maybe you can find this tool. Unfortunately, though, that shark doesn't have a good track record as far as extra tools being available. It may eventually be available, but sometimes their, their parts department on their website, I've noticed stuff's always out of stock, it seems like. It'll come in stock, but then you don't know it. So again, I really do appreciate everybody's support. I love what I do. I love getting these products. Would I buy either one of these? This... $291 is a good price point for an auto empty system with a cordless vacuum cleaner. Not $400, not because you're getting this extra tool. Now be careful. In my videos, these filters right here, that little screen right there you see, it can clog up very easy. If stuff gets wrapped around it, you're gonna lose all suction. Stuff will start falling out of the handle. So you have to, if that's the case, take it back to the auto empty base, auto empty it, and then start vacuuming again. So there is a little caveat. It's not a big, robust vacuum cleaner that you're gonna vacuum your entire house. You know, you will lose suction if you start getting a bunch of dirt and debris in there because it's gonna wrap around that cone filter and you just lose all suction. And cleaning that HEPA filter can be extremely dirty. You get really, really fine dust in it. So be careful with that. I've even had, you know, even these filters down here, they get really dirty. Even, the bagless feature is nice, but you do end up with some work. You know, I, I'm torn between bag and bagless. I know with bags, you don't have the extra work. You just put another bag on and then you're ready to go. With bagless, there is some extra work, but you know, um, again, I really do appreciate everybody's support. I will put links to these in the show description. Also be sure and check out my next video where I do four shark auto empty cordless stick vacuum cleaners. Check me out on Instagram where I do free giveaways and on my Facebook group page. I'm also on TikTok, have fun over there. If you could hit a follow, I really would appreciate it. If you could hit the like and subscribe button and thanks for watching. 
So if you could check me out on Instagram, Just a Dad Videos. I'm also on Facebook group page and I'm also on TikTok. So I love what I do. I love giving you the most honest reviews that I can give you. I buy the products with my own money. I'm not paid for these videos. That way I can keep telling you exactly how I feel about these. So again, I really do appreciate everybody's support. If you could hit the thumbs up button and subscribe and thanks for watching.